This morning we're measuring the biomechanics of some javelin throwers, so we're using a 3D motion capture system to measure the angles, velocities and accelerations of the throwing motion of our elite javelin throwers. I'm going to be doing my normal throw session, but I'll be marked up for a study that the AIS is conducting, looking at the specifics of javelin throwing, uh, angles, measurements, or velocities, all sorts of things like that, uh, to help technically improve what I do on the runway. So we've got some pretty good data out of the last project that we did and it'll be even better to have today to be able to compare the two. So it's done a fair bit of work since the last time we ran it and it'll be really good to compare the two pieces of data to see in detail what sort of changes I've been able to make. From a research perspective we're trying to quantify the, the movement as from some short approach full approach throws to give us an idea of the load on the athlete as they throw so we can uh, help design training better. And from a performance perspective, we're trying to look at our javelin throwers technique and see whether there's areas that they can optimise and go away and work on so they can uh, come back and test again and see them improved. And hopefully we'll give them a performance gain heading into Rio. Kelsey's on track. She's had a really good domestic season and a little tour of Europe where she hit the Olympic Games qualifier. And we're about five weeks out now and she's on track, she's healthy, she's strong, and she's uh, starting to throw really far in training, so things are progressing well. I think my trip's going really well, uh, not just for World Champs this year, but for Rio next year as well. Uh, I trust my preparation, I trust my training programming, so everything should come together really nicely. Yeah, I don't feel like I've hopped into those ones. I can honestly say that I wouldn't be where I am today without the help of the AIS. The facilities that they provide and the opportunity for me to be able to get the servicing that I get, all of that combined has made me the athlete I am today.